So hey guys, welcome back to my channel for tutorials. So guys, today I'll teach you how to create new and cool style of logo animation with using trap code plugin. So see guys, I show you my logo. See guys, that's my simple PNG format file. Okay, so now guys, that's my After Effect. Okay, so guys, go to on project and right click import and import file. Guys, import your logo, this one, and drag and drop like this. So guys, full, that's my resolution and fit to 100% check, right? See guys, that's my logo, that's my PNG format file. Okay, so now guys, I create new composition. So click on here, create new composition, like a logo, animation. Yeah, and guys, duration 15 seconds is good for me. So press OK. Okay, so next one guys, go to on project here, guys, select your file that's my logo and drag and drop like this and next one guys i take new solid layer and solid layer rename like emulator like this and press ok so guys switch layer guys see that's my logo layer create 3d so click on here 3d layer okay so guys hide and now guys go to on emulator and this time i apply trap code plugin so trap code use particular like this yeah and guys click on here okay so now guys go to one emulator and see guys that's my particle guys i will increase so guys type i use layer yes and layer emulator i take this one logo like this yes see guys that's my particle okay so now guys go to one zero frame and particle second check guys I like 0 and now guys go to on like a 1 second and particle take 1 like 1 and 5 times 0 enter like this ok but guys see that's not correct shape so guys go to on firefox logo this one logo and see guys that's my extra part so uncheck like this see guys that's my logo and guys go to on like a 9 second 9 second guys select your emitter press u and click and guys now i go to like 10 second and emitter particle 0 okay so guys go to back and play yes see guys that's my simple logo right it's really simple okay so guys go to down and guys select all keys and press f9 like this and guys go to back and play yeah right that's really simple okay so now guys i change velocity velocity like 25 like this yeah good and guys go to again back and play okay so now guys all is good so go to on particle and guys see that's so my feather feather i like zero yes and size guys size little bit change like a four is good four and see guys that's my size random i like 100 yeah like this it's really good okay so now guys go to on shading and shading on and second one off okay so next one guys go to on physics and guys air and you go to on turbulence field yes so guys fx size i like 30 and fx position i like 500 for beautiful particles guys take little bit time because that's my heavy effect yes see guys that's a beautiful particles right it's really simple okay so now guys i create animation dynamic animation and guys physics go to on here world transform see guys that's my all rotation and see guys second one that's my position okay so guys all check rotation all check and guys rotation number i like minus one guys i choose randomly numbers like this like a one and guys see that's my z offset check and guys z offset like a minus 500 yes okay so guys now go to on like a 10 second 10 second and all counts are like zero 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 and zero yes 
ओके सी गाइस दैट्स माय ऑफसेट आई लाइक सेम जीरो यस ओके सो गाइस नाउ ऑल इज गुड एंड गाइस गो टू बैक एंड प्ले या सी गाइस दैट्स माय रोटेशन एनिमेशन ओके सो नाउ गाइस इस टेक लिटिल बिट टाइम फॉर प्रीव्यू सो आई चेंज दिस वन रेजुलेशन सो गाइस गो टू बैक एंड प्ले Okay, so guys, now I stop this preview. So guys, take more time, and guys, now go to back and play. Yes, see guys, that's my beautiful dynamic particle animation. It's really good, right? Okay, so now guys, I create simple background particle, and guys, my first animator is finished. Now guys, duplicate, press Control D. and guys see that's my emitter and rename like a emitter 2 like a bg that's my emitter background and now guys i change some setting so guys go to on here emitter so guys see i select emitter bg and guys velocity i like 250 it good yeah guys is depend on your work like 200 is also good Yes. Okay. So now, guys, go to on particle and size. I like only one. Yes. Really good. See, guys, that's my background. Simple background. And now, guys, again, go to back and play. Okay. So, guys, now I stop again. Now, guys, go to back and play one more time. Yes, see guys, that's really cool. Okay, so now guys, I little bit increase velocity, background velocity. Select like a two fifty is good for me, two fifty. Okay, so guys, resolution use full. Yeah, see guys, that's a beautiful particles. Now guys, one more time, go to our project. Guys, I create final animation, final touch up like a create new, and guys, rename like final. logo so press okay okay so now guys select your logo drag and drop and now guys i create masking so guys select circle ellipse tool and guys create circle so holding shift key shift and now press control actually yeah control okay so guys all is good select and guys alignment so go to on here align Yes. Now, guys, this time go to on effect and presets, and guys, I apply turbulence. So, guys, select this turbulence and apply on shape layer like this. And guys, amount I like hundred and complexity like ten is good. Yes. So, guys, now, guys, I create animation. So, guys, go to on like a eleven second, and guys, scale size. That's my shape, guys. Shape I like zero, and guys go to all like a thirteen second, and shape increase, guys increase like this, like one twenty five, randomly. Yes. Okay. So now guys switch layer and see guys that's my logo to change this one alpha mat check, and guys go to back and play. Yeah. See guys, that's my simple particle animation, right? Okay, so guys, select and press U, and select all, and press F nine. Yeah. Okay, so guys, go to back and play. Yes. See guys, that's my simple animation. Okay, so guys, now go to on logo animation, this one, and select all layers and press U, and guys, go to on up. Guys, select all keys. Select. All and press F nine for smooth animation. Okay, yeah, all is good. Okay, so now guys go to down and guys go to on project. Guys select your logo animation and drag and drop on here like this. Yes, simple guys, right? Okay, see guys, that's my final animation. And guys take little bit time for preview. Yes, and guys increase frame like this. Yeah. And guys, go to on here. Yes, see guys, that's my final one. 
it's really beautiful and next one guys i take some color correction and apply sharp effect so guys i use adjustment clear and guys i apply sharp sharpen effect and apply to adjustment clear like this and guys amount little bit increase like a 20 is good for me right and next one guys i apply curve simple curve tool adjustment clear and guys little bit increase here yeah, it's good and down yes it's good see guys that's my simple color correction and yes much better see guys that's my curve and sharp effect and without curve it's looking this one is thick guys it's really dull effect dull color and now that's really sharp and beautiful color vibrant color okay so now guys my final effect is finished guys take little bit time for preview okay so guys that's it my final effect is finished so if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel and guys you can download this template from my website it's free thank you yeah.